everyone and welcome back to my channel. First I'll show you how to upgrade this home decor piece that I purchased at Dollar Tree. And it was in the three and five dollar section also known as the plus section. And here's the skill. As you can see it is a great color. Um, they also have them in black and white. The white ones that they had had a couple of chips so I ended up getting the gray one. And as you guys know I'm a bling girl. So I want to decorate this up a little bit more. So what I'm gonna do is take this outside and spray paint it gold. So I'll do that and then come back. All right, so here's what it looks like gold. And look at that, isn't that a drastic improvement? Um, it would be even more beautiful in silver. But I really like the way it looks in gold. Okay, when I spray painted it, I spray painted the front, then I made sure I angled down to get in here. And then I also held it upside down to make sure that I got underneath it as well. Well, quite a few of our YouTube family members wanted to see something done with gold leaf. Okay, so I decided to go ahead and do this in gold leaf. So what I'm gonna do now is take a paintbrush, some gold and silver leaf adhesive, and just brush it onto the areas where I wanna add the gold leaf. Naturally, I wanna do the piece right in the center. Okay, so now I'll allow this to sit up for like 30 minutes. Then I'll come back and add the gold leaf. Okay guys, so it's been about 30 minutes. So now I'm gonna go ahead and start adding my gold leaf. And here I have some that I purchased from Amazon. And I'll be sure to link it in the description below the video. Now Dollar Tree also has gold leaf. If you saw the last video where I used silver leaf, it comes like in a container. It is actually pieces of gold leaf and silver leaf that you can use. It's easier for me to use the sheets. And since I already have the sheets, I really use these. All right, so I have this brush. And now I'm just gonna put it on there and brush it on. It's so easy. So simple. Now you can see how much of a difference it makes. So I'm just gonna go ahead and add some more to the other places. So now what I wanna do with the base is add a little bit more blink. And I have some of this gold mirror tile. And I've been having this quite a while, guys, so this is the perfect time to use it. I found this at Amazon as well. So what I'm gonna do is add some mirror tile to the base. It's almost a perfect fit. And now I wanna just measure and see how many tiles it would take. It's gonna take four rows. I'm going to take my utility knife and just cut it. And then I'll glue it right on the front. Now I'll go ahead and add some around the rest and then come back. Here's what it looks like with the gold mirror towel around the base. And I think I want to add some right on top as well. So let's see how that goes. Yeah, I like the way that looks. Okay, and just like that, I'm done with the base. Isn't that pretty? Just like that, we have a whole new piece. Isn't that gorgeous? So naturally, I'll let you guys see this on display. And now we're gonna move on to DIY number two. 
which is a Christmas DIY. Okay guys, I'm back with DIY number two. I have this faux fur wreath that I found at Dollar Tree. And as you can see, it's $5. It was in the Dollar Tree Plus section. Here's what it looks like on the back. There's a hook that you use to hang it. I'm gonna do a simple design, nothing too fancy. It's already really pretty with the little silver streaks in it. So let's just go ahead and remove this tag. I have this ribbon that I found at Dollar Tree. And I have this doorknob hanger. I'm gonna be using that. Here's just a quick little bow that I made with this ribbon. I'm not the best bow maker, that's something I need to get into. I have some string lights, because I do want this to light up. I'm not sure what else I might add to it, but I'll figure it out as I go. Um, but the first thing I wanna do is go ahead and wrap these lights around me. This is the top, so I wanna hide glue this right here. And I'm making sure that the screws are on this side so I can change the batteries when needed. Okay, so I'm just gonna start from the inside and just start wrapping it around. Try and make sure that it's even all the way around. Okay, so now we have our lights. Okay, again, this is the top. First thing I wanna do is glue this on to my wreath, like so. I'm gonna hold this down until the hot glue sets up, then I add some more hot glue. Okay, so now we have this. So now I'll take this bow and glue it right over the loop. Um, do we like that? Is that a look? I guess we can add them on there. So we have six of these. These, and I'm gonna add five. So what I'll do is just cut this off and just glue this on. Okay, so I'm done. And here's our free. So what I'll do is hang it and come back and let you guys see what it looks like.